retail real estate broker either works for you, the tenant who's searching for real estate, or like as in the case with Graffito, works on behalf of the landlord, which is what's most comfortable to us. That's typically who we work for on the GSP team. The interesting part of all of this, which we spoke about at length, and if you look at the video that we have posted uh, as a companion to this piece we talk about in our City of Boston workshop, is that oftentimes it can be hard to gather who that broker is working for. And what we stress to all of you is you need to ask, right? This is something that you would think is known, but oftentimes in the search for real estate, it can become a little bit confusing as to whether or not the broker works for me or the broker works for the landlord. And the best way to resolve that is to ask the broker, are you working for me or are you working for the landlord? Now, what's really interesting in the context of retail real estate is regardless of who that broker is working for, the landlord most typically, but not always, will pay the fee for the broker. Now, if you were going to engage a broker as a restaurateur, as a retailer, as a creative who's looking for space, the other question to ask is whether or not that broker is working on an exclusive basis or not. Our recommendation is that you hire a broker and you work with one broker. It eliminates confusion in the marketplace. It streamlines conversations. And then you as the tenant know who is actually on your side and don't have to have the conversation multiple times. Are you working for me or are you working for the landlord? I will just flag one other matter, which happens often, which is at times, it's not uncommon, uh, that a broker will actually be representing the landlord and may actually also represent you, the tenant. This is called dual agency. And again, it is hypercritical to be upfront with your broker, understand who they're working for, regardless of who they're getting paid by. And I think it's a really responsible thing for you, the tenant, to figure out if you are in fact gonna be working with a broker. And if you're looking for real estate in the city of Boston or Cambridge or Somerville or beyond, you're gonna come across a lot of brokers. So again, make sure you ask the question.